So I set up a youth club um, during lockdown for young people to have somewhere to um, meet up and socialise midway through the lockdowns. Um, as, as time's gone on, that youth club has grown from being around 10 young people to around 30 to 50 young people a week. Young people come, they're able to socialise, interact with each other, play board games, um, have a kick about with a football. I absolutely love working at this youth club, um, seeing the young people um, each week grow and develop into uh, amazing young people um, and building friendships with each other um, and also building relationships with the youth workers there as well. It's been really rewarding to watch the young people return each week and build their friendships with each other. Monday nights are the best part of my week, seeing those young people show up every week um, and say hello, um, sit down and start having a chat with us. I can't put into words how much I love leading that session and working with those young people. Uh, we worked on Project A, which was working with Afghan families and their children. We provided sports activities for them whilst they were living in accommodation uh, to learn about cultural differences and prepare them for their school life. We used football and cricket because that was something familiar to them um, and their English progressed loads. Um, so obviously these refugees have um, come to these hotels and they've come with nothing. They also have nothing to do. So these activities were really a way for them to learn English, um, learn about the culture differences here in the UK um, and really learn how to engage with boys and girls together where they wouldn't have had that opportunity back home. Um, and they really took a lot of those skills when they were um, placed around schools and in their new homes and lives.